Welcome to Real Food, and today I'm going um, to do a review of uh, some of my John Lewis uh, food boxes. And these, um, they are not really, I wouldn't call them essential food boxes, but these are more more um, treats, they're more hamper style, hampers um, with really nice um, um, delicatessen or some specialty types of foods so I went on onto John Lewis website and um, they offer um, a variety of different hampers uh, food hampers there I mean they're very popular I have to say a lot of them um, you know when I went there a lot of them uh, were out of stock but I ordered a couple that were still in stock and some of them are seasonal um, such as this one this one's called Henley hamper and also for those who are watching um, this video in outside Britain, I know there are uh, subscribers and um, viewers in, in the United States. And I don't know actually if John Lewis does have any stores in the States or in other countries. Um, they probably don't. Um, so I'll explain briefly that John Lewis is one of the nice, um, slightly more expensive um, um, supermarkets. Um, but what makes John Lewis very, very special is that the company is a partnership and they make all the people who work in that company a partner so all people working there um, from cleaners to cashiers to management they're all partners and they're all really interested in the success of this company they're all benefiting they're getting uh, bonuses incentives etc so generally speaking it's a very good quality company in Britain. People really like this company, um, people like working for this company, and I've never met a p somebody who worked there and didn't like it, or, 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 or left the job <laughs> unhappy. Maybe such people exist, I mean, if you do know them, you know, or maybe you are one of them, please do comment. But from, you know, from what I've seen, it's a really good company. And they're not actually overpriced. When you go to their shops, they're very reasonably priced. So they've got general purpose department stores and they've got um, uh, food stores. Their food supermarkets are called Waitrose. And those who are in Britain, we, we all know them. Um, they are more expensive, actually, than other supermarkets, but they're generally very, very nice. Um, the stores are kept beautifully. Um, they offer um, unusual foods, more expensive foods, which you can't find in other supermarkets. And um, the staff is very friendly and very helpful. So anyway, these hampers, they come not from Waitrose. You might think it's Waitrose. No, they actually come from John Lewis, from their main website. Because these are food hampers. They're not um, food boxes. So they, it's John Lewis um, that does this. And you can order them online. So anyway, let's go back to um, this Henley hamper. I will mention one one more thing for those who um this is a seasonal hamper and it's more of a, like a treat like a luxury and Henley also traditionally um hosts um Henley Regatta it's a festival um around this time of the year on um, on Henley and I suspect that this year it will not be happening but typically during these um festivals it's very popular to have a picnic so this um um, Henley hamper that I ordered will be in this sort of style, picnic style. So it comes in this um, nice box. And sorry, I've already started actually eating because these treats that they sent um, to me, they're really, really nice. So, it's a fairly small hamper, but it comes with its own tray. So it's a really nice tray, which I will reuse, and I'll show the tray later to you. So what you get, you get a selection of things, including, including alcohol. So one thing that I've nearly finished, I've got one left, is shortbread, which comes from Shortbread House, Edinburgh. And shortbread is a traditional Scottish biscuit, which is very rich. It's got a lot of butter and sugar, so it's a very nice one. But what I'm going to say about this particular one is that not only it's your what you everything that you expect from your shortbread, this one also has a really amazing caramel um, flavor to it. You know, it's the sort of caramel flavor I've never experienced in any other shortbread I, I I bought from stores so it's a really really amazing shortbread so it's shortbread with um, rich dark chocolate and it was full package a pack you know I've already eaten pretty much all of it <laughs> another thing that I've already eaten and I'll tell you it's absolutely delicious it's this they've got this small snack which is sweet chili peanuts and cashews I mean you think so what's so special you know 
cashew nuts and you know with some kind of seasoning yes and that's what I thought but let me tell you the seasoning that these guys are using here is really really amazing well I really liked it it it's it's got everything right and as you can see I've practically eaten well I've eaten the whole of it so what oh another thing that I already also tried is this um it's the strawberry jam traditional again strawberry jam which you would have during picnic and again this is a really really nice one it's a small sized jar just enough for your picnic maybe for two people so this one I haven't tried yet but it's a really nice um, Peruvian chocolate so it's a small sized 50 gram Peruvian chocolate then um, they included a bottle of red wine and this one is, um, let me just um, take it out of there. This one is Cabernet Sauvignon, um, so from Chile, 2018. I haven't tried the wine yet. It's it's a very personal thing, you know, some people like Chile and others don't. But I'm sure this is going to be a very nice, um, based on uh, what I tried so far, um, these nuts and snacks, they're all very, very nice. Okay, this I haven't eaten just yet, but these are um, oat cake bites. Simply delicious. Also Scottish. So um, I'm going to open and show you what they look like inside. Let me just do that. So the oat bites look like this. So it's a selection of biscuits, oat biscuits, um, which you can use um, with your strawberry jam and maybe with other snacks. Um, and I think this is it. So, and everything comes in this really nice tray. Let me get this tray out. Which you can reuse. Look at this. This is a fantastic wooden tray. And I'll definitely be keeping the tray and reusing it. So, and this is your Hanley hamper. So, it's a nice picnic uh, with wine, biscuits, um, and various treats. Um, and I will also I'll go um, online and show you uh, perhaps um, how I ordered it. You can order one yourself, and I imagine these types of hampers potentially they could send them abroad as well. So it's not just within Britain, but you could get one if you're abroad. But you do need to check that website whether they actually do it. And so I've just um, taken this hamper uh, out of the box just to show you the tray. So this is what it will look like um, in this beautiful wooden tray. Um, and you definitely want to keep this tray because it's very, very nice. You can reuse it um, for your um, uh, balcony, for your picnics and, and other events. Or just keep it um, at home for, for your normal kind of use. Okay, and um, here's the, the website where you can order this very hamper. And I've just checked it. Um, it's still available, although it's a seasonal hamper, but you can still order it. And they still got it in stock online. So if you go to this johnlewis.com and you search for uh, Henley Gift Basket. So they don't call it a hamper, but they call it a Henley Gift Basket. Well, mine was actually called a hamper, but they, it looks like they've now replaced it um, with this new one that says a basket. And you will get, perhaps instead of a tray, I got a wooden bee, but you might get a, um, a basket, as shown in the picture here. And um, I also wanted to um, mention that if you search uh, for more hampers and food baskets um, on this site, you'll find um, quite a good selection, actually. I, in fact, am quite impressed. Um, that there's um, a very large variety of different baskets, foods, food boxes, hampers. Um, you can find others are small, um, uh, gift um, uh, versions. Um, they're generally a bit more expensive than those, let's say, 25 quid um, or 35 quid um, large boxes that you get from Aldi or other super discounters. But these are um, slightly more luxurious. Um, there are more fancy items in these um, um, boxes from John Lewis and of course they um, include um, uh, branded items which taste really really delicious from what I've seen so I highly recommend to try and check um, what's on offer in there 
So and now uh, let's quickly review what was included in this Hanley hamper or Hanley basket. So they've um, included um, a bottle of red wine, Cabernet Sauvignon. Um, it's a small bottle, but enough for two people, definitely. They've included um, smooth, simple chocolate, hazelnut and raisin, 50 grams, delicious, was beautiful. Um, they've included the indulgent one strawberry jam, 114 gram. Um, this was a really nice strawberry jam, I really liked it. Um, they've included um, brilliantly baked sweet chili peanuts and cashews selection, 45 grams. These were actually, I have to say, the best I've ever tasted. Um, it was so nice. And they've included um, uh, mature cheddar cheese oat cake bites. Um, I tried those now, actually, and I can tell you they're really, really nice. So, this is my review of Hanley Hamper or Hanley Basket. Um, which you can still order. Uh, thank you for watching. I um, hope you enjoyed it and I'll chat to you again soon.